Hey guys, I'm just uh, starting on my tractor. Uh, there was a couple things I wanted to fix before hay season and um, I don't know if you guys ever saw them, but the hydraulics, uh, how they connect, I always hated them. Always hated them. So I'm going to take them off and switch them out with a standard uh, hydraulic coupler. So that's the plan right now and it's in a really tight spot and uh, yeah, it's a pain in the butt, but we'll get her done. So this is after the massacre of what I just did and took it off. These things used to be on like that, if you guys remember. And these, uh, the pins on the top right here, always caught your fingers. This thing would slam down and snap your fingers. And these things are kind of, uh, they're wonky. I never liked them. Um, the one doesn't work very well. And anywho, I never, I was never really a fan. So what I'm going to do is... I'm going to switch them off with regular couplers and uh, make my life a little bit easier. The one hydraulic lever in the tractor broke because I didn't know what I, I didn't know what was going on and it wouldn't work and then it snapped off. So um, I'm just I'm not frigging around with these European ones anymore, but I would make every mechanic cringe when I had to take these things off. The plastic things came off easier than I thought, but these things were an absolute bugger. And what I had to use was vice grips. It was the only way I could get them off. I took this one off right here. Um, they told me originally they weren't rebuildable. I think they are. I don't care. Um, they wanted $300 a set. So this is $900 for these stupid things. And they just don't work as good as the North American style. So I'm going to switch them back. And uh, one of the things that uh, becomes a skill when you're farming is kind of memorizing which stores will have what. And it doesn't seem like much, um, but when you're running around for parts, the last thing you want to do is go to a store that you thought would have something that doesn't have it. We have a guy that's uh, near us that has all these weird European style parts um, and all this stuff that I really like because the prices are good and he always has stuff that is a little off the ordinary and uh, that's usually my go-to spot. TSC is anything generic usually but they're usually more than a standard uh, store um, because they're a box store so I'm going there. I'm, I'm not going to GSC. I'm going to the regular um, I said that place that's got the weird parts that you'd never find anywhere else European and American. So I'm going there. I'm going to go pick them up and uh, I'll show you guys what I put on and what goes on from here. So this is about as far as I got here. Um, you can see that I only replaced three and the other three aren't there. Um, there is a little, um, what I see, a conversion nut or um, a fitting so that the standard couplers fit on. They only had three of those in stock, so I have to wait for the other three. Um, I just put them on there loosely so that I can easily take them off, and uh, they're ready to go. So that's the plan. Um, I have a little more of this video and showing some other stuff I'm working on on the tractor. It kind of got stretched over two days, so I'm just uh, puttering away on it, and i got a few things done. Thanks again for watching, guys. Feel free to comment, rate, and subscribe as always.